<clears throat> Hello everyone and welcome to this audio podcast. Uh, in this series, uh, I like to the Labstorm uh, Impact V3. This is an audio podcast. I like to uh, I like to uh, work some research. Um, I sort of uh, retrospectively uh, uh, carried out um, between 2017, uh, 2017, 2018, and uh, 2021, uh, and tw- uh, 20, uh, 2021. Um, this works uh, looks at uh, sort of uh, nef- uh, nephrology research in context of of uh, what if any uh, any of the uh, health educational needs uh, for patients with chronic kidney disease and CKD. Um, this audio podcast um, um, will look at um, um, will look at and provide a sort of an overview in aligned to a discussion and conclusion and some summary points are uh, in line to uh, in uh, in, sur- in surrounding the research in in its um, in 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 in, uh, in entirety uh, in 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 context of enti- entirety and audio podcasts that have been. Uh, had been uh, sort of um, uh, uh, had had been uh, highlighted um, uh, uh, highlighted context around different aspects of the research sort of uh, previous to this. Um, so this is another audio podcast uh, aligned to a storm robotics blockade um, and uh, an audio podcast uh, aligned to uh, another storm robotics uh, production. So um, uh, so uh, sort of uh, cracking on. Um, so aligned to the discussion. Um, uh, whilst uh, whilst there whilst there was some overlap uh, relating uh, and regarding themes and uh, inductive content analysis, um, re- uh, this research had highlighted online spaces can be used in, uh, in, in uh, sort of uh, can be used sort of in, in inventively uh, to help uh, highlight how um, patient and public involvement uh, can also play a role on developing educational support uh, through. Healthcare systems. All CKDPs or CKD uh, participants or patients were in between. Uh, were in between uh, CKD severity, CKD four, and CKD five. Telephone interviews were short, but allowed participants to put forward views and understanding relating to educational needs and patient care. Uh, using um, using an uh, an inductive content analysis approach. I uh, had uh, uh, had helped uh, gain sort of a, an understanding of um, of the of the uh, of the research of the research and the research question um, and um, uh, and healthcare and healthcare requ- uh, requirements specific to uh, CKD sufferers access to uh, allied health professionals or AHPs through online spaces uh, could also provide um, patients um, uh, with educational support improving quality experience experience and evidence based practices mentoring mentoring training and patient sharing experiences should be uh, should be about inclusivity um, and empowerment patients and families will also require educational support surrounding guidance on self care access access to ahps ahps uh, through online space um, could uh, could also provide patients with educational support in improving quality, experience, and evidence-based practices. By 2030, if not before, AHPs can perhaps expect to be better uh, integrated into pathways, uh, into pathways working through online spaces and uh, and um, uh, so and um, for example, um, group consultations. Um, having access uh, to a network of AHPs prompts uh, CKD patients. Uh, CKD patients to be um, to be more included in aspects of healthcare, thus increasing practical understanding of disease treatments, disease treatments, and uh, and overcoming overcoming educational barriers and addressing possible health healthcare inequalities. Peer to peer interactions can be used to educate and um, empower patients, but alone, uh, uh, but alone, uh, it is inadequate, inadequate, and imperfect. Um, whilst there is some um, novel uh, educational projects and proposals, uh, pro- uh, pro- uh, pro- uh, projects and sort of project uh, pro- uh, and uh, sort of proposals taking place, joined up thinking, uh, sort of would would prompt uh, a smarter working uh, relationship uh, relationship across professions to drive um, an all encompassing 
sort of um, approach to CKD um, uh, and long-term condition uh, LTC care pathways to convey um, better uh, outcomes uh, for patients, a patient's future. Um, there is also there is um, there is scope for service development uh, and initiatives uh, are re uh, relating uh, patient uh, care through online through online uh, education and peer support. But there needs to be a coordinated effort between uh, service users and service providers to understand how and where inclusion can be improved, uh, including online and social media platforms for healthcare education provision. So in line to uh, sort of the conclusions around this works, um, after documenting interviews were um, critical in generating themes in preparation um, of uh, inductive content analysis or ICA implementation, 19, 19 uh, interviews uh, between four cohorts were conducted um, with an, with a requirement to respond to, with a requirement to respond so this research uh, informs that there is scope for education uh, educational service development and initiatives um, initi initiatives focusing on AHP uh, allied health professional involvement but there needs to be um, uh, a coordinated effort uh, between service uh, service again between service uh, users and service providers. Uh, aligned to this as well, a point of care education or P, uh, something that's been um, inferred, inferred as point of care education or PO, uh, P, uh, uh, POCE uh, could be integ integrated through online space. Uh, for example, the renal patient support group, the RPSG, and linked to ele electronic patient records or EPRs. Educational support is thus required wherein there is access to AHPs prompting advice, prompting advice, guidance and support through online spaces aligned to, aligned to uh, traditional physical uh, sort of consultations. This research informs um, that co-developed education modules could, could, be, de um, could, be, delivered, uh, could be delivered between patients and allied health professionals uh, educational modules could be linked through social media platforms, integrating a proposed educational pathway, uh, a proposed uh, in, in, in integrating a proposed uh, education pathway for CKD patients, um, so that public health, so that public public health and uh, research uh, um, meet practice meet practice excellence. So in line to uh, in line and finally some uh, uh, the sort of uh, main points or the summary points in around this works. So number one, uh, educating uh, healthcare professionals surrounding the importance um, of, pa um, of the patient role um, and how to be more interactive with patient care still requires uh, a sort of integrative, integrative practice. Number two, uh, targeting the attitudes and behaviour of providers um, uh, uh, of providers through potential solutions is important, uh, so that the relationship. So that the relationship between the patient, the, between patients and the, uh, sorry, between service users and service providers or patients and health professionals is balanced and smarter. Number three, uh, patients um, and carers or service, service users still want more face-to-face -face understanding of test results um, and between the two social, between, uh, and between, um, between sort of two, um, between the RPSG and also uh, uh, a sort of a uh, 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 an, uh, uh, a a a a um a social media uh, social media platform that um is is um uh, works in context works and, and focuses on a pediatric or young population uh, referred to uh, uh, as referred to in 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 previous uh, in previous in some previous um audio podcasts uh, kidney uh, uh, uh kados kidney uh, kidney disease and renal support uh, for uh, for kids or kados for kids there has been implementation of of pilot patient of of a sort of pilot patient and uh, a AHP or allied health professional webinars to deliver educational support through uh, through a media such as um, th uh, through media such as Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram. Um, number four, uh, smarter working will help in meeting challenges uh, on educational needs uh, to uh, support CKD patients, and this is this this will also reduce. Sort of fatigue, uh, increase, uh, increase streamlining healthcare, uh, healthcare services 
to reduce um, existing impacts. Um, number five, and finally, uh, ultimately, by by efforts, um, by joined up efforts between allied health prof uh, allied health professionals, AHPs, and CK and CKD patients, the aim between between, uh, for example, um, between uh, the RPSG, uh, the RPSG, uh, a social media platform, um, and um, and for example, once again, uh, KDOS, um, uh, and KDOS uh, is to equip is to equip patients with education and knowledge uh, to ensure that they have a strong basis uh, for shared decision making throughout kidney care. So that now uh, draws this um, this uh, audio podcast uh, to 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 an end. Um, there will be um, some some resources in in uh, in in the descriptives um, uh, on 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 social media where where listeners and viewers can check out uh, more uh, more inf- uh, more sort of um, uh, information around literature around literature surrounding this uh, this uh, sort of series um, this series of um, uh, of uh, audios and podcasts uh, audio podcasts um, and uh, also where where uh this works this works now um uh uh now has uh has been um has been uh uh the 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 form the former um the formal the formal other uh, sorry the former um the formal um uh peer review manuscript has has now been accepted for publication um and so um uh, uh so listeners and viewers can expect um uh, the uh, the site the sort of um, resource in around uh, that public uh, in around the citation around that um, uh, to be uh, sort of made available uh, as part of the audio podcast um, in the descriptive on um, on social media uh, in 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 and around this um, uh, at some point um, uh, as well. So uh, thank you for tuning in, and uh, once again, this has been an audio podcast. Um, uh, an audio uh, an audio podcast on to the series the lab storm impact v3 this has been an audio podcast around uh, sort of nephrology works nephrology research surrounding, surrounding what if any other healthcare educational needs uh, for uh, patients with CKD or chronic kidney disease uh, and again uh, this has been an audio podcast aligned to uh, a storm robotics blockade and uh, another storm robotics production thank you uh, for tuning in and hopefully um, following this, uh, there will be a uh, a Bostix feature, so look out for that. Thank you. Take care.